Hi guys and welcome to our latest YouTube video. Please like and share if you enjoy our content. And don't forget to subscribe for more dog related content. Today's topic is the Chihuahua. Are you considering getting a Chihuahua? Maybe you already have a Chihuahua puppy. Either way, let's have a look at the pros and cons of this lovable bread. The Chihuahua is the cutest breed of dog you can have at home. There are many theories that discuss their origin. Some theories state that they came from Asia or America. They have stolen the hearts of many people, but owning them is a big responsibility. As the Chi is a small dog, there are many things you must take into consideration. Before picking this cute furry little dog, you need to analyze all the pros and cons. Here we provide you with all the relevant information so that you can make a decision. Pros of owning a Chihuahua 1. Chihuahuas are adorable and cute. They are one of the cutest dogs I have ever seen. They are so sweet and small that they can easily get fit into your arm or lap. They are very loyal and caring. It is fun to be with them and watch them playing for long periods of time as they are very affectionate. They will love you unconditionally. You can make homemade dog food as a treat to your loved pet. 2. They are excellent pets if you are living in an apartment. A chihuahua is small in size. They do not require large spaces or fields to play. Your home can provide a lot of space for him to run, roam about, and exercise. 3. Good watchdogs. Chihuahuas have excellent eyesight and hearing capabilities and having them around provides security at home. It will alert you if a stranger enters or trespasses into the house. They are considered great watchdogs. You will feel less stress that burglars and thieves are sneaking in with these little guys around. 4. They are good learners and can be taught to use the litter box. I trained my chihuahua to use the litter box inside my home. You tell them once that you have to litter here, they will obey you. Use newspaper or organic material inside the litter box. 5. This pet dog is easy to groom. Do you fancy having a well-groomed puppy? It takes only a few minutes to groom your chihuahua. You just need to give them a refreshing bath and trim their nails regularly. As this dog has short hair, minimal time is required for brushing. Long-haired chihuahuas take a little more time but are much easier to groom than some other breeds. 6. They have a longer lifespan. This breed of dogs lives between 11 and 20 years. Ideally, they live more than 15 years. The longer these dogs live, the longer you will be able to spend and nurture them. 7. They are a perfect travel buddy for you. Chihuahuas are small in size. Traveling with these cute, furry canines is very easy. They are so small that they can fit in a lady's handbag. They love to travel with their masters and can become comfortable within small spaces. Therefore, carrying them along is convenient. 8. They are super intelligent dogs. The Chihuahua breed is quick and intelligent. They are perfect for learning things, therefore, training them for various habits is easy. Cons of owning a Chihuahua 1. Chihuahuas are fragile. You must take extra care of them. The Chihuahua is a comparatively weak dog and can easily get injured. They can hurt themselves even when falling from a couch, so special care must be required. For instance, I ensure that my Chi doesn't linger around electric cords, fences, heights, and large beasts. I watch him constantly to prevent injury. 2. You have to keep them warm. It is hard for a Chihuahua to survive in cold weather. They love a warm climate. You must put some clothes on them if you are going out with them in the cold. 3. The Chihuahua has the tendency to bond with a single person in the family. Yes, my Chi is closer to my mother more than anyone else in my family. You must have noticed the same in your house as well. They usually aren't family dogs as they are not able to create a bond with the entire family. If they feel uncomfortable or threatened, they can nip or bite. However, if this dog is raised and socialized from an early stage, they are excellent pets. Children may not be able to take care of the fragile dog. Simple and rough handling can easily harm him. 
Most chihuahuas do not get well with the young children as they fear they will get hurt. Chihuahuas must be handled with care. 4. This pet dog barks a lot. Chihuahuas are not the best choice of a pet if you are living in a location where silence is required. If the walls of your house are not thick enough, the barking sound will go outside the house. Chihuahuas are very particular about their territory and the place where they live. They don't adapt well to changes in locations easily. You can train them to overcome this. 5. They are very sensitive and can have health issues. There are two sensitive spots in the body of Chihuahua. Melora, it is a soft spot on the skull where the skull does not close fully. Patella luxation, it is located where the kneecap slides in and out of the tendon. This condition causes a lot of discomfort. Their skeletal system is weak and thin. Avoid letting your Chihuahua do high impact exercises. These conditions, melora and patella luxation, are easy to control with regular health checkups. They require a lot of attention and care towards their health. 6. Chihuahuas often do not do well with other animals. Other dogs can hurt them while playing. If another dog snaps, it can be life-threatening for him. Kais tend to prefer other Kais. Of course, there are exceptions and some Chihuahuas get along great with other animals in the household. They are prone to eye injuries so think twice before having a cat at home. My, Chi, is adorable. No matter how noisy he is at home. I cannot live without him, nor can any of my family members live without him either. You have all the benefits and drawbacks of having a Chihuahua clear now. So, decide for yourself, whether or not to get one. For me, they are simply irresistible. Additional information. Types of Chihuahuas. There are two varieties of Chihuahua, the long-haired and the smooth coat. You may have heard of toy or teacup Chihuahuas. We consulted the Chihuahua Club of America, the AKC's official breed club, to get to the bottom of what this means. Their official statement is here. The official AKC breed standard describes the Chihuahua as a small dog that comes in two varieties or coat types. The difference in coat type, the long coat and the smooth coat, is the only official description used to identify a difference within this breed. Our standard does not categorize the Chihuahua by size. For the purpose of showing and record keeping, the American Kennel Club includes the Chihuahua, along with 19 other breeds, in the toy group. Therefore, irrespective of their weight or physical stature all Chihuahuas registered with the AKC are considered to be a toy breed of dog. As with all living things, there will be a size variance between individual dogs within this breed. Look within the human family, brothers and sisters will differ in height and in weight, as well as other physical attributes. They are described as humans, male or female, and there is seldom if ever a need to break the description down further. The same holds true in regard to the Chihuahua. They are Chihuahuas, long coat, smooth coat. Unfortunately, the additional adjectives used to describe the size differences and physical appearances are many and have been misused for so long they now seem legitimate. Teacup, pocket size, tiny toy, miniature or standard, are just a few of the many tags and labels that have been attached to this breed over the years. The Chihuahua Club of America is concerned that these terms may be used to entice prospective buyers into thinking that puppies described in this way are of greater monetary value. They are not and the use of these terms is incorrect and misleading. Occasionally, within a litter, there may be a puppy that is unusually small. That puppy is a small Chihuahua and any other breakdown in description is not correct. To attach any of these additional labels to a particular puppy is to misrepresent that Chihuahua is something that is rare or exceptional and causes a great deal of confusion among those new fanciers who are looking for a Chihuahua. The Chihuahua Club of America does not endorse nor condone the use of any of these terms and would caution the prospective puppy buyer not to be misled by them.